Hi, I'm George Bissett Jr., driver of the number 39, Oscar Roofing and Sheet Metal, SK Light. But up front, here comes Bissett. He moves down underneath Sears. Bissett has already been to Victory Lane once this season. I got into racing from my dad. He's been doing it for 40 years. And we're going to continue this legacy one step at a time. Really, just started out in go-karts on Monday nights. Uh, we did that for a couple years and moved up to the street stock division, or the dare stock division at the time. Uh, won a championship and a ton of races. And now we're in the SK Light division. We have two wins in two years, and uh, we're going for some more. I've, I've looked up to many people. I mean, I looked up to my dad as a racer, especially. I mean, it is your father. I always like, you know, Keith Rocco and, you know, Ted Christopher. And I just like the thrill. It's really just somewhere to get away. And it's just, it's really just stress relieving. I mean, a lot of people think stressful. I think it's stress relieving. I mean, you're in your own little world, nothing matters, and it's all about you. George Bissett Jr. takes down the impressive victory. He'll do it with style and finesse. Racing at Stafford, like my dad was, and, you know, all these super famous people that got their names on the back of the billboards, you know, writing down history one lap at a time is pretty cool. I mean, me and Nick Anglais are pretty close, so, I mean, it's cool to beat him. Nick's, Nick's interesting, you know, he's either, he's either uh, taking down the wall or he's passing you, so, I mean, it's, it's kind of fun. Love you, Nick, don't give me crap for that one. Probably when... Me, Travis, and Nicole Shambrello. Nicole flipped over, okay, and I got pissed at Travis. And then, again, Travis is my best friend. Like, we were like brothers. I have no idea Nicole flipped. And I was on the warpath. I mean, the warpath, okay? I, w I got in, <laughs> I was gonna jump in Travis's car. I was gonna beat him up. But I said, you know what? It's not worth it. I'm gonna go in the ambulance and I'm gonna calm down. So, that'd probably be one of the men most pissed off times I've ever had. Probably a little more collected, uh, patient. I try to be a lot patient. Sometimes a little too patient sometimes. I kind of critique myself on that. Go George, you only got 20 laps. Like, I'm thinking it's like 80 laps or something. So, you know, sometimes, you know, I gotta kick myself in the butt. I gotta say, probably, I mean, I'm, I'm still stuck on that 30 lapper race on the street stocks. I mean, that was pretty cool. If I won the 40 lapper this year, which we almost did, the 40 lapper would be it, but I'm gonna say the 30 lapper. The people. I mean, there's so much connectivity with fans. You can, I mean, fans, crews, friends. I mean, anybody can get involved in it. It's just, it's just a different world.